Hey everyone, Mike Rosart here talking to you guys today about mentorship and the value of real estate mentorship partnerships. And that's a lot of ships. Um, <laughs> the ship is sailing, guys. No, seriously, okay. I have this idea. I'm just kind of thinking about this out loud. I hadn't thought about how to plan this video out in great depth, but it's sort of more of a vlog or, or my, my ability to share something. And I get a lot of people now reaching out through YouTube and on Instagram and Facebook and all these different avenues where they want me to help them be, you know, help coach them through, you know, the journey to financial independence, whether that's, you know, on the personal finance aspect, how do you invest and build budgets and save. And on one hand, I want to let you guys know, I, I have now mapped out a 30 day financial transformation course, and I've got it all mapped out all 30 days. I've basically 75 pages of content. I'm going to release this course, uh, sort of a PDF ebook with accompanying tools like budgets, net worth calculators, all these sorts of tips and tricks and uh, I'm really excited to sort of unleash that. I'm going to do it for free on YouTube. I'm going to do for you guys and let you know that I really want to do a um, an intro video where I walk through the, at a high level what the 30-day financial transformation is all about, what that course is all about and then for over a series of maybe 30 weeks I'll release one video each and every week be day one, day two, day three of this transformation and the idea is that someone could find this and do watch one video per day. So one intro video plus then 30 days of videos. And each day they would be a different topic. So it's gonna cover everything about spending less, earning more, and maximizing returns. But I'm gonna get into the minutiae and the details. So things like, um, you know, how do you get your house in order? Do you house hack, rent hack? How do you maximize the best, you know, use of your, your personal residence and where you live? And how do you get a deal and become, you know, more efficient to spend less and have the same impact. So stuff like that, talking about dollar utilization, investment philosophy, talking about not just real estate, but more or less about investing in general. What is your investment philosophy, investing in exchange traded funds. I'm gonna teach you guys how to build a budget, how to stick to a budget, how to build a dream board, how to set goals effectively, how to stay motivated towards that goal. It's gonna be, a, uh, there's gonna be tons of really cool videos. I've got 30 videos mapped out for you guys. Really excited to, to really un unleash that content out there for free. And I think this 30 day transformation covers a lot of, basically if you took the, if you watched all 30 of these videos and applied all 30 of these things, you'll be retired in less than like probably four or three years even. Um, but less than five for sure if you followed all of these 30 day, uh, 30 day topic or tips. Talk about everything from, you know, uh, dividend investing to, um, you know, how do you save on half your grocery bill? I'm gonna go in and film myself shopping and show you guys some of that, some of those pieces. How do I, how do you get your cell phone bill down in half? How do you cut your transportation bill in half? How do you get, get you know, deals on, how do you save money on your taxes? How do you pick up a side hustle and, and learn to really um, grow your income on the side, not just your primary job. How do you learn to earn more? How do you spend less? How do you maximize those returns? And what is financial independence? How do you retire early? How are you retired at 25? Because I think at the end of the day, freedom is what we're actually after, most of us at the end of the day. So that's one, one thing I'm, I'm doing for you guys um, that I really want to release and it's going to be free. The ebook and the tools might be some nominal fee like $4.99 or $9.99. And I only am doing this because I think it'd be really cool to actually attach a monetary value to this because I if someone's willing to give me their money, um, even just a small token amount of five or ten dollars, just say like, "Hey, Mike, you provide a lot of value to me." That's cool. Um, I would really get a lot of. Um, I think money is super valuable, and so when someone gives me five dollars, I like treasure that. Money to me is is so. Um, when someone gives you their money or their time, it's like one of the most valuable things they can give you, and so I think that's really really cool when someone gives you that money. So I might even monetize it in a way to be able to give you better content. Cause I'm gonna take all the money that I get from this course and reinvest it into my equipment on YouTube, um, into creating better content for you guys and, and future courses. I'm hoping to be able to hire someone cause I've been so busy to help me with um, growing you know, the property management business, helping investors, um, as well as creating content on my blog. I'd love to partner with someone. If you like to write about personal finance and you wanna help me, I got my website Fired Up Finance. I'd love to get that going as a part of the um, 30 day financial um, transformation course. I would love to also have someone who's a financial planner or who enjoys doing financial coaching partner with me because I don't have time to be on the phone with a dozen people a week, but someone else might. And, and there are people who are willing to pay for that coaching. And so I, you know, if, if you want to partner, reach out to me. Um, that might be something cool. People need financial help. Like I was reading a scary statistic the other day in, in the news that 90 
7% of Canadians save less than 10% of what they earn or something to that effect. And the average Canadian and North American saves like 5% of their income. And that is like disgusting. That is not going to get you there. Even 10% a year is not going to get you there. You need a little bit more. You need to juice up those returns. You of course need to be saving a lot more. You need to find strategies to earn more money too. So life coaching, financial coaching, whatever you want to call it, I think people need that. There's a lot of value for that. So I'm putting that out to the world that with this free course, people are going to want more detailed discussion and coaching. I just don't have the capacity while still spending time with my family and enjoying my life to some extent to, to be there for each and every person. But I want to help. And you know, I, you guys know I, I did work a little bit as a financial planner and I've done a lot of financial plans and I really enjoy that, that piece. So if I could coach someone or mentor someone through that, that opportunity is there for you guys. Reach out, let me know if you wanna do that. Um, I think there's a huge demand in the marketplace right now for automated financial planning as well. I'd love to see a website or a tool that exists so that people could do their own financial planning um, there, and they would sort of through the website recommend certain products as opposed to the age old like mutual fund sales and insurance sales crap where they're paid a commission to sell you something. That doesn't feel right to me. I, I can't get behind that. I honestly just, just can't. Um, so there's, that's the one, one half of, of ways that I feel like I can help a lot of my audience. The other half of my audience, um, while they can benefit from this too, also needs help with real estate and mentorship with real estate. And so I don't know if that means creating a course that I can offer for free because I just like giving things away for free and I, I like it when people get value from things that I create. But, and I wish someone had been there for me seven, eight years ago when I had bought my first um, you know, property and I was still looking at things and, and really getting interested in real estate and personal finance. I wish I'd had that mentorship. I've actually never had coaching before. Um, I've had a lot of mentorship in my life, but I never really paid for coaching. So I can't say that like I really had any of those really great coaches, but I hear really good things from people that are involved with those people and, and getting that coaching. So I think there might be value there. And I'm thinking, well, with my time, how do I, how do I help people? And what is the best way to help people? And I think with real estate coaching, the single best way to learn is not to pay someone a fee and then have them teach you about real estate, it's to do. It's to be involved in active deals. And so that's why I wanna create a mentorship program, just an idea I'm throwing out here, where I take someone and they take them under my belt and we buy a property together. I'm talking about a property in London, Ontario, right here. You, know, you might come and stay with me for a while and, and shadow me or you drive into the city once in a while and we actually, I show you how we renovate the property, how I run the numbers, how I buy the properties, how, how the deal comes together from start to finish. Ideally, it's someone who's wanting to work really hard and carry most of the weight and I could be more of the mentor, more of the expert. The nice thing being if they were able to get financing and have the down payment to buy a property but didn't have the expertise, I could share them with them all those skills and so this would be almost a mentorship program where it's a win-win. Uh, maybe I get a 30 or 40% of the profit on this deal, or even 50% of the profit on this deal, and they get 50%. And it was a huge learning opportunity for them. So instead of paying me you know, a bunch of money for coaching, they paid me in some of the profit on the project. And so if there's no profit, if, if, I don't, if, if what I say, if what I preach isn't true, if we can't practice what I'm preaching in the real world and make real money, then I don't get paid anything. And that's the way it should be. Coaches shouldn't get paid unless you make money. Like, I, I honestly do believe that. I hate when people take fee for service. It doesn't really feel right. Um, it feels the best when you're partnering with someone. So I think partnership might be the best way to go. I'm just throwing this out there. It's more of a vlog, guys. What do you think about um, me creating a course for that, maybe for real estate, doing more of the partnership method? I think that makes a lot more sense. Partnering on deals, and then my time to coach you is returned in the profit you're making on the deals. So if I'm, do, if I'm effectively helping you um, find good deals and then manage them effectively through through the coaching and the mentorship, then you're gonna make a lot of money. You're gonna re reach an accelerated profit level. And then I'm gonna win too, right? So win-win scenarios are the best. Um, they'll align the interest so that I'm motivated enough to actually wanna get on the phone. Because I'll be honest, guys, you know, I'd much rather be spending time with my family or gaming or you know doing that kind of stuff than be on the phone 12 hours a day talking to people. So it's not, I don't really wanna be doing coaching. I just don't find there's a ton of value there. And I don't think I would love my life doing that each and every day. Um, it's just not really something I enjoy. I do enjoy talking, you know, one to 10,000 to a camera. Um, I'm getting some fun, some really good enjoyment from that and people that are reaching out, it feels amazing. Like when you guys reach out and you, you leave me a comment on this YouTube um, video or on other YouTube videos asking a question, I light up. Like you'll see I leave, sometimes I'll leave really like book long responses to people and I love when someone else gets to read that comment and then get some value from that. The more people that can get value from what I'm sharing, um, the more I feel like I'm giving back in the world. And you know, honestly, when I, when I reached financial independence and I sort of retired for a bit, 
I found that there was an emptiness in my life and I needed to um, unlock some of my creative side because I, I do have a creative side of me that I like to explore and I like to be active and productive, right? But it feels empty to just do it for my own sake, right? It just feels like, you know, I'm already financially independent. I have way more than I need in passive income for my family for the rest of my life. And I don't need a bigger house, not really. I don't really need, you know, multiple cars and a Ferrari and all these things. I could have them, you know, I could work really hard and just, I could get those things, I'm sure of that. But wouldn't it be more fun if I was actually aligning with what was good and what was right? And I feel like what is good and what is right is sharing your talents with the world. And I think that I have some talents I can share with the world Money management is like my thing. Like I, I live and breathe anything personal finance, real estate related. It's just, it's just me. I just love that stuff. All that content, all those blogs. I just eat it up. All those books that I've read. They just, I eat it all up and I love it. So I want to share and give back. And I think that a lot of what I'm doing with this, you guys know this real estate business where I'm, we've already bought five properties this month and I had this goal of, of buying um, a property a week. So 50 properties a year. Um, with investors in, in our corporation or partnering with investors in certain ways and maybe I only own a quarter of the deal or maybe I own half the deal. It depends on, on the deal and, and what if I'm willing to put up capital or not and all the certain you know factors for each and every deal and every deal is different but it allows me to scale really big where I can make a lot of people a lot of money and that would feel really good because I'm giving back at the same time. I'm teaching and I'm mentoring and I'm sharing what I'm doing but at the same time I'm also growing and I'm learning and I'm, and I'm exploring new, new sides of myself that I didn't didn't explore before. So that's sort of where I'm at right now, guys. If I can do a deal a week, wouldn't that be cool? Like just think about how how cool that would be if I could get from, you know, I bought about 25 properties with partnerships or myself or, you know, assisting people with that. Imagine if I could do 100 deals or even 1,000 properties. At uh, 1,000, 100 properties, 250 grand a property, that's $25 million in, in assets we're talking, at gross assets. I know that's levered up quite a bit with mortgages and whatnot, but that's a ton. Now imagine a thousand properties, that's 250 million, uh, if my numbers are right. Might be wrong on that. But the quick math, that's, that's, that's huge. Um, that's, you know, that would be so cool to do. And imagine with those types of financial resources at my disposal, the good that I could do for people, right? Like I would love to, to start programs on financial literacy. I'd like to have a financial literacy program that went into the schools and, you know, that I could, or I could send then that every, every student in, in Canada and the United States saw these videos and learned from and benefited from. So that'd be something that would be really, really impactful. And that's why I'm growing right now is more or less to help other people. And that's the truth. That's the honest truth of it. Um, it is kind of fun, obviously, to make more money myself. But uh, yeah, that, that's where I'm at right now. It's just a vlog, guys. Just throwing out here, seeing what sticks, seeing what people want. I know I need to make more videos for you guys. I've just been really, really busy. And now I'm going to try to make more content for you as I create the 30-day challenge. So um, anyway, guys. As always, spend less, earn more, and maximize your returns to unlock a wealthier you. Bye.